the events of Brazilian love affair continue to shake the nights of Boca Raton. The whole month of September brings to the city some nice samples of Brazilian culture. It's going great. There's a whole half month left um, filled with activities and shows and fairs and it's going to be really great experience and I'm glad that it's happening in Boca. In this Wednesday, September 11th, the stage of the Funky Biscuit had a great night of batuque, samba, and funk. Yes, these three styles form the name of the band. It's called Batuque Samba Funk. The fusion was an idea of Diogo Bra. I put this group together uh, with the idea to mixing like funk music, 70s, and Brazilian, basically. And um, of course, we have a lot more. I think you have to check it out. In terms of influences, I would say that the main influences are uh, Jorge Benjó on the Brazilian side and James Brown on the American side. That's why the band is called Batuki Samba Funk, because uh, our idea is to do a little bit of uh, traditional Brazilian samba mixed up with old school American funk. We're actually in the, in the process of recording our first album. We're very excited about that. We are also recording our first music video. And traveling between these three styles, Batuki Samba Funk gave people a great time at the Funky Biscuit. was contagious and it didn't take long until people could no longer just be sitting and watching. Brazilian music. I lived in Brazil twice in my life and this band is really outstanding. They've got all the rhythms, they play well together. We hear about Carnival and now we have it here in Boca. I think it's terrific. I can't wait for them to come back. And I absolutely love this band. If you haven't checked them out, you're really missing out. But Tuca Stema Funk is where it's at. To get more information about the next events of Brazilian Love Affair, please visit www.brazilianloveaffair.com.